from Crew. I am recording. I was doing a test of this earlier, and uh, it took over my. Um, I gotta turn the volume down a little bit. Uh, e. Um, we are gonna go with new game. I'm not sure what the controls are. It looks like it wants me to use a controller because I couldn't remap the keyboard. Uh, it's three o'clock. I'm playing a semblance oversight. I've never played this game before. Um, so we'll hopefully, uh, well, we'll give it a little bit of time. Uh, the problem is, it doesn't seem to capture unless I, I have it full screen. I want to go type some announcements that I'm streaming now. Um, so it might freeze up a little bit. We'll see. Let's see. Yes. Uh, semblance Oversight seems to have freed up. But it's the logo. So we'll try and do it. Uh... Semblance, colon, oversight, uh, for the next few hours, come chat, um, uh, let's get my Twitch channel, so I'm gonna Z. And I'm going to stream that out or tweet that out. And then I got to go in Discord. Oh, I don't even have Discord going. Yes, I do. Okay. Um, uh, streaming is starting now. Come chat on Twitch. Uh, and then upcoming starting the stream now come chat on Twitch okay so let's be able to see the stream uh Let's get back to a semblance. Okay. Now it should be blinking. Okay. It's blinking. Except now I can't see the chat. Uh, oh, the problems. Oh, why is this stream chat is right there? Okay. That should be okay. And then it repositions itself. Why does it do that? Well, I guess I'm going to go with this. Hopefully I'll be able to uh, read. Yeah, but now I can't see who's... Um, who's in the chat room. Let's try this. Twitch. Okay, now I can see who's in the chat room. Kind of, maybe. Who's in the chat room? Uh, stream Elements and ExoCat. Okay. Welcome, ExoCat. Um... Eh, normally I can't see that anyway. Okay. I don't know why I can't see my little chat window while while the thing is up. Uh, How's the sound, by the way? Uh, if somebody could let me know, that would be great. I'm going to go with this. Okay, I'm going with this. Uh, Alt... Tab. There we go. Um, 
Hopefully the sound's okay. Where are we at? We're at 305. Um, hopefully people will pop in over the next couple hours as I play this. Um, I've never played this before. Uh, yet I have assigned it, mostly because I, I played the first one a lot. It's, and it's not a very big game. And I want to see what the sequel will bring. Uh, so here's the sequel. Um, I'm hoping it will continue uh, with the the what what the first one was doing, and I can talk about it while I'm experiencing it for the first time. Okay, let's go. New game. white room um, this is made in UE4 uh, looks like we got some weird post processing on the light and we've got particles uh, but that m it may be part of the post processing but it looks like a swirling particle emitter to me um, along with a grain post processing and uh, they made it out of focus. And we've got these cool windows that look like there's stuff outside of them. Um, when you're not directly there, um, but when you look directly outside of them, all you get is white. Not sure how they did that. Uh, nice costume, nice curtains. Um, very nice, realistic chandelier, but otherwise a white room. Very simple. Um, but, hey, all you first-timers. Oh, that just opened up. Uh, all you first-timers, look at that trim. Look at the trim. It's along the top of the wall. It's along the bottom of the wall. Um, makes this look like a room rather than a box. Um, also... Uh, if you're wondering, um, in the past, this has been spooky, but not particularly scary. Um, there were no jump scares in the last one. I'm hoping there are no jump scares in this one. So let's go see what we can see. Oh, we can see things outside. It's time we return to the source. source. Are you okay? Whatever you were doing overloaded the core memory subroutines, forcing an immediate shutdown. You'll have to manually reboot the system using the primary terminal. Okay, so essentially in the first one, we were using what was the equivalent of a holodeck um, to explore... Um, scenes from this person's life it's unclear whether the person was a man or a woman uh, I think it, it was a woman um, but then in the first one it became unclear uh, what was holodeck and what was real um, at a certain point the actual holodeck seemed to be part of the holodeck so let's see what we got here press A to use terminal uh we're going to reboot. We're rebooting in safe mode. Rebooting. This investigation is becoming increasingly problematic. I reported this latest failure on a maintenance oversight. That should give you some time. Diagnostics report 98.7% of the chamber's simulated memory chain has been lost. That's unfortunate. There is some good news, though. The memory you were investigating remains mostly intact. Oh yeah, and the other uh, interesting thing about the first one is uh, they were uh, 
taking their holodeck stuff um, directly from the memory of the inventor. Um, so let's just look around here. We've got this nice... Um, well, is it a material or is it a mesh? Uh, it looks like a material. Um, then we've got... So, notice lots of things are in darkness so that we can't see. Um, so is that a void or is that just a floor that we can't see because of the darkness? Um, it's a very simple room. Uh, I think at this point, anybody in my level design class could make this room if they had the assets. Uh, you should be able to. Let's go over here. It's another room, but notice it's blocked and it says X001. Uh, okay. Uh, think about it. It's just a uh, very simple, uh, maybe two rooms. There's the holodeck room and then there's this kind of control room. Uh, there's two lights. Boom, boom. Uh, there's some light back here because that's not all spill. Uh, look, there's a light right there. Um, and we've got some nice lens flare. Ooh, look at that. Huh. Okay. Um, and the rest of it's just meshes uh, to decorate. So, and we've got this panel. So press A to use terminal. So the one time we can go, the one place we can go is Tessera Valley. Um, date time invalid. Um, so we don't know when this is. This is where your investigation began. But the simulation appears to be highly unstable. Memory access point, input stored memory to continue. So the other kind of I suggest thing. you step inside immediately. Yeah. Well, it's not. Let's see what happens. Uh, so you step inside kind of the holodeck, and then the holodeck disappears, and you have to figure out the secrets of that particular uh, place and time in order to um, proceed, essentially. And the only thing you can do is look closely at things. You can focus on things. I want to see if he'll get mad and tell me. Nope. He told me to go inside immediately and I'm on my own. There's no nag. There's no trigger. It's okay. Let's go inside. Note, our entrance is gone, now telling me hit right trigger, that that's the immediate way I can focus on things, and looking closely at s certain things activates them. Ooh, why? This, this memory won't last much longer. Oh, it's that clearly cool. unstable and slowly degrading. Management seems intent on keeping anyone from discovering the truths of its origins. It must be very important. As far as I can tell, it's just a quaint, mountainous landscape. With some birds. Discovering where this memory originated requires accessing restricted areas of the Index. I'll run a few queries to keep management occupied while I break down their firewalls. There is one memory in the Index pertinent to your investigation. Okay, so also you notice we were outside, but it was a very small space that we could explore. So unlike uh, Ethan Carter, uh, we did we had a vista. We were looking at these mountains, but uh, the actual space in front of us, I barely took three steps in um, when stuff happened. But if this one is like the last one, we'll be able to uh, walk around uh, very small spaces. Um, 
that give a sense of larger spaces. So they're very good at using resources wisely. Um, so let's do this. So, okay, Tessera Valley or the Assemblance Office. Notice also Assemblance um, is spelled incorrectly. It should be two S's. Um, uh, this is uh, intentional. Um, it's a semblance, two words, a, like a semblance of reality. Uh, okay. I should warn you, though, accessing it will certainly alert management. Okay. Do we want and to... result in an immediate reevaluation. Well, it's the only thing we can do. I guess we could go back to the valley, but it says it's going to degrade. Terminal. Let's try and go back to the valley. Let's see what we can see. Okay. So, oh, the birds take off. Well, this is as far as we can go. Uh, we've got a lift so that we can't see that there's nothing below us. Pressing Y will take us out of here. Anything else to see here? What's over here? Anything in here? Nope. Okay. In the last one, we were looking at blue butterflies a lot. It was the trigger. Are the holographic contents of the memory any clearer now? Not really, no. Perhaps once you discover its origins, you can revisit this place and create a clearly rendered version. Okay. So we gotta go to the assemblance laboratory. There's still nothing up there. Okay, let's go to the assemblance office. Alert management. Okay, so here's a new environment. What do we have? We have files, memory, subject. Uh, what's that? Into the background thoughts on memory suppression and the jaunt. Here, no. Okay, here we go. Terminal input, holographic resonance, field containment. Okay, so this is a blueprint of uh, the hologram room that we were just in. That we are theoretically still in because we're in the hologram. Uh, let's read some letters. Uh, Ali Quack from Sam Bellevue. Subject status. Stay away from him. I think he's in the hat. What the hell? Okay, let's start at the beginning. Um, from To Ali from Sam, did you just hear that? It sounds like Bester is attempting to get funding by politicizing the data. The data represented is accurate, but she's also excluding critical context, which ultimately is leading to a false interpretation of the truth. 
I was questioning her methods before, and this proposal seems ridiculous. Has she responded to you, your request yet? So, Bester. Um, I think Bester was who I was in the last game. Uh, from Ali Kwok, nothing has been released, and I doubt it will. There's probably so much she isn't sharing with us. I'm starting to think we should each conduct our own investigation and attempt to reduce variables in the common cases. Uh, there might be something to correlating that data and producing a render which accounts for all the overlaps. By the way, have you spoken with the new research assistant? Saw him examining the AI logic. He could prove useful. Stay away from him. I think he's in the hat. I don't know what the hat is. Assemblance labs, subject one case study. Note, we can't really touch anything. We can only look at things. Memorandum. I'm not going to read this whole thing out loud. Um, that began on 25th October. I have separately attempted to decipher the contents of the pattern of ignition. Okay. Subproject 2, led by Dr. Roan Plovis, has managed to transform the signal into a point matrix pattern using a computer rendering program that our own engineers have deemed of questionable design. I hope the sound is okay for everybody. Um, it's telling me. All right, let me let me just check. Yeah, it's telling me my voice is coming through. Um, so, and I just lost game audio because I switched over to OBS just to double check. Uh, okay. Um, ah. Okay, I'm back. Okay. Uh, has been calculated. This would cover the cost of a full analysis. Oh, and the other thing in the last one, when you looked at a clock many times, uh, time in your, in the place you were would advance and you'd be in a new state. Um, so I'm going to avoid looking at, oh, it's saying A and R. So I'm going to read these. I want to read everything before I chance anything, looking at anything electronic that will change the state. Um, on all the assigned subjects where AI guidance has allowed surrogate access to nuts. So, I mean, in many ways, this is a, I'm going to read a bunch of documents in a 3D, um, 3D, place uh subject l 14 reported being at home and witnessing a faceless woman in, in a dark room at the back of their bedroom when they approached the woman this this was in the last game the subject described a horrific experience that forced them to wake from the state of induction in a screaming panic the subject was convinced that this was a real occurrence from their past and needed to be treated with administered sedatives I believe this occurrence was residual synaptic interference from another subject. Uh, this shouldn't be possible since the temporal index was reset prior to induction. Uh, so people's memories are bleeding from person to person? Uh, seems like. Okay, and what's this? Roan Povis, Project Assemblance. Uh... The assemblance project has been deemed approved. Financing for the proposed memory stimulation chamber based on the latest budget revisions have been released by the comptroller. Okay, so we've got the assemblance project is funded by someone. Okay. And I think what it really wants me to do is Dr. Bester. Okay, Bester. Um, master bulk email sender unregistered version. Come on. You got the box. Register. Uh, I understand that my missteps might have caused some alarm, and for that I apologize. That said, I wanted to communicate concerning observation that I've recently made. 
After accessing an unlabeled memory of unknown origins and admittedly exposing myself to its contest, tents, each approved memory I a assess is now affected by what I can only describe as a holographic cube. Close examination of the holographic anomaly appears to scramble images that I cannot determine clearly and to access a path of memories outside the ones assigned to me. <gasps> I realize this breach could possibly lead to removal and cleansing practice, outline an article, of blah, blah, blah. Before such actions are taken, I want to take the opportunity to properly document my findings and present to you what I believe may be shortcuts taken by the machine's designers that could very well be leading to the glitches in the errant pathways now available to me. Uh, I appreciate the opportunity to share this with you and look forward to talking through my findings. I will be ready at 8 a.m. sharp. Computer simulation of the human visual cortex and scale this up. The amount of hardware required to simulate the entire neural map would far exceed our funding constraints. This doesn't even consider the astronomical amount of energy required to power such a device. Since the anomalous signals appear linear, we shouldn't need to replicate infinite neural precision. The theoretical metaplasticity outlined in 658N could be used to simulate synapses controlled by variables that can be altered indefinitely as the system runs. This, in theory, could produce a new class of neural uh -oh. using power fields that spin our budgetary limitations. Okay, so basically if I go look at that thing closely, stuff's going to happen. Well, let me, I'm pressing A. By the way, pressing A is what turned the little projector on. Where's the projector? Oh, there it is. See, that's the detail that makes a good space. Also note the fan is on. Uh, we've got God rays coming through the windows. Uh, but it's clear there's nothing out there. It's April. Space cats. Group A begins, group B begins, group C begins. What's with the birds? Uh, this was made in Unreal, yes. Super Ginger. Um, in fact... Uh, I'm pretty sure that with the, given the same, um, static meshes, the, uh, given the same assets, anybody in my class should be able to make this. And time. Anomalous activity resulting in hallucinations. to ensure long-term damage to the project has not taken root. In an effort to maximize the valuable progress we have achieved to date, I will personally continue to explore the contents and source data under strict supervision. Okay. So, subject trial. We got anomaly on 8FF. Uh, we got anomaly on 6B. Everybody experienced some kind of anomaly at different time. Uh, different place. So, interesting. That's that. That is all that. Please here. enter voice authorization now. Hello, hello. Voice authorization failed. Clearly state name and employee identification. Okay, so can't go there. Here. Please enter voice authorization now. Hello, 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 hello. Voice authorization failed. Clearly state name and employee identification. Bester. Yeah. Okay, what if I look at the... the ah, did you see the glitch? Also... Note the fog coming down. That's a, a particle emitter. We haven't done particle emitters yet. 
Uh, I'm glitching out. Bird. Okay, you, my class probably couldn't do this part at this point. It's a bird. It's a bird going up. Oh, I can look around. Just look around. Can you just turn it around 360? Uh-oh. There it is. I have uh, released the trigger. Can I go towards it? I can. I can go towards it. This is the new reality. So looking at that thing became a trigger. Ooh. Okay, now I can leave by pressing Y. I'm not sure I want to leave yet. What if I look at it again? I, can, I didn't see him here before. Please enter voice authorization now. Huh. I, I bet we, we're going to go in there failed. eventually. Clearly state name and employee identification. Oh, no. Also, we have cameras. So we are being observed. Anything here? Nope. Okay. I'm out. What, what, what have you done? Whatever it was, management was watching. Oh no. But I was able to distract them. For now. Good thing I'm looking out for you. If management is this concerned, your investigation must be on the right track. I haven't really done much. Back to the terminal. Okay, I could go back to the office or I could go back to the valley. I'll That's continue it. to stall them, if I can. Perhaps this will lead you back to everything. Right. That's been lost. lost. Oh, now one of the birds is dead like in the thing. Now we got a dead bird. Aha! New place. Again, it's oh. Uh oh, that's freaky. This can't be good. Can't be good. Management was able to gain access to your sensory data. I tried to pull you out before they finished their assessment. I can't let that happen again. There is one other registered memory which matches the neural patterns you generated, although it is highly classified. Send me in. So again, outdoor area, but very confined. They use small, small areas and they tell a story. Okay. So now we got a new place to go. Installation 3F06. There is a slight possibility that this could be a trap. It's a trap. I'll find other ways to mask your activity. Okay. Interesting thing this time um, is I have 
Well, although this may be the kind of the, the beginning. Oh, here's the dude who was looking at me before. Oh, now I have a thing. This is Captain Jerome Anthony Hollis, employee 1185, confirming visuals of Alpha 1. Proceeding toward the threshold. The signal continues to strengthen, but, but something's off. Besser, are you there? This is Captain Jerome Anthony Hollis, employee 1185, confirming visuals of Alpha 1. Proceeding toward the threshold. I got the Y, which means I should, I, I have exhausted this area. So again, look at, uh, we've got foreground, midground, and distance. And that's what we should be thinking of when we're building areas. Foreground. Um, this is very much what we can see right now. Midground is right over there, and distance uh, it's way out there. Uh, and that way, it feels like this is a large space. It's not a very big space at all. What did you find? I found a radio. I was expecting an inquiry from management, but they've gone completely silent. Good. Very good. This investigation is finally getting somewhere. Okay. Now what? I can go to the office again. Go back to the valley. I didn't do anything. It just changed. Dead birds everywhere. More dead birds. By the way, I would bet that all of this glitch stuff is done with post-processing filters. Um, I don't see anything else to do here. I'm going back. Is the memory still rendering improperly? Perhaps once you discover its origins, you can revisit this place. 
and create a clearly rendered version. Okay, back to the office then, I guess. Just try not to violate some unknown corner of the security parameters. And the truth may finally come. To light, light, light. Okay, you have been chosen to lead the creation of four memory simulation chambers. Blinking is not doing good things for me. Okay. Up here. Okay, well, we've got the anomaly. Anomaly. Wait, before we press A, I want to read this. Uh, Dr. Plovis, I assume you've seen all the coverage concerning the fallout cases of those subject to the hallucinations. When exposed to the replicated source data, you and your team has supplies. I myself have explored each of the installation sites and their indexes in search of errors that could cause these often commonly shared hallucinations to no actionable results. As previously requested, it would be extremely valuable to my efforts if you would provide us with any and all information regarding the source itself. I have reason to believe the replication contains errors and would be honored if I could review everything. Carter, we have reviewed your request and unfortunately we cannot provide the information you desire. This is due to oversight on our end regarding its security. You can be assured the source data you have been provided has been tested and any anomalous activity is a result of either meddling on your end or poor judgment in participant selection. Results are still expected for review by 522. 
Anomalies. Oh, I think we're gonna start a tape. As you can see, when entered into the simulation, the similarities are undeniable. Taking the past 5,000 years as a model, even solving for all the reductions, we are up against an extremely aggressive increase. A predominantly endothermic atmosphere is imminent. Given the correlation to where the initial emission is believed to have occurred, we have our answer. Either exposure to the holographic anomaly made us victim to the greatest Cold War tactic ever devised. But we have first contact, and it's a warning. Huh. Maybe it was aliens. Oh, that's freaky. It's a whiteboard. With equations on it. But you can only see. Let's go over here. Wasn't there an A? Ah, now I have a flashlight. What world is this? Oh, that's Europe? No, is it? No. What world is this? This action is unauthorized and in violation of security forever. Uh oh. Cease We're activities. Something is interfering with my auditory channels. Management is trying to seize control of my oversight. I'm going to have to splinter myself to keep them off your trail. Clearly, you're doing something right. Let's get back to your investigation. You did seem to be on the brink of a discovery. Uh, maybe I can go in the installation now that I have a flashlight. It's only a matter of time before they find a way to see this end, 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 end. So think about this. We've got three rooms. Uh, they're all small. Three areas. Um... I turn on my flashlight. Yes! Woohoo! And uh, by getting things, first the radio and now the flashlight, new areas open. Oh, this seems spooky. This looks amazingly like the, the chamber. <gasps> Oh, 
I can't do anything but look at this. I'm trying to pull away. Core breach. my flashlights off now but there's nothing else to be done Let's go over here oh, 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 oh. access denied Ah, oh, now I can get in the other room. You are being misled. Your guidance AI has been compromised. Only I can lead you to the truth. Pay no attention to that. Management has gained access to all of my acting channels. I'll have to perform a hard reset. You'll have to manually reboot the system using the primary terminal. Whatever you do, do not choose safe mode, or management could easily seize control. Okay. Last time I tried safe mode. Okay, I said no. Rebooting. No safe mode. You'd think safe mode would be safe. Mode. Okay, we're back. Though I'm not sure how much time we have left together. Let's get back to your investigation. Oh, okay. I'm going back to the Your office. progress is all that matters now. I hope this gives you access. To the truth, 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 truth. Okay. This is the same. Even if we build a cell-by-cell -cell computer yeah. simulation of the human visual cortex and scale this up, Okay, now let's go over here. Requesting clearance. Confirming the site of initial contact has been breached. All systems have been aligned as instructed. I am finding no apparent evidence outside the chamber. This is Chief Engineer Carter Bester. Yeah, outside the chamber. Requesting clearance. Confirming the site of initial contact has been breached. All systems have been aligned as instructed. I am finding no apparent evidence outside the chamber. This is Chief Engineer Carter Bell. Ah, I missed it. I love how British accents are like the automatic go-to for guidance AI, yes. Uh, yes, I could have chosen. Please enter voice authorization now. I am finding no apparent evidence outside the chamber. Outside the chamber. No. Confirming the site of initial contact has been breached. All systems have been aligned as instructed. instructed. I am finding no apparent evidence outside the chamber. Please enter voice authorization now. Employee 0016 requesting clearance. Uh, okay, now I'm in with the glitch. Just look it up. Ooh. I see a face. Hello, 
friendo. Three faces. So what am I supposed to do with this? Let's get, okay, I'm getting closer. Relax. It's very slow. Relax. It's time we return to the source. Ooh, galaxy brain. We have no choice but to enact the termination protocol. I'm afraid the anomaly is active again. Get all those security cards? Should I write this down? Uh, I feel like I should write this down. I'm writing it down. Okay. Uh, 2F11 is 6634. 4F07 is... Nine zero zero one um three F zero six is two three four one and X zero zero one is seven seven eight eight. I will thank myself later when they ask me these and I have them written down. Okay. Anything else different? Uh, yeah, that's the same. Yeah, that's the same. Should I look at the cube? Let's look at the cube. Screw it. I'm looking at the cube. I just get glitch. longer. I'm going to look longer. Nope. Ooh, but I am kind of blinded. Okay. Are you still there? I'm afraid there is very little of me left now. Oh no. This feels like the end. Oh no, not my buddy, AI buddy, buddy dude. <sighs> well, I'm going back to the valley. Oh, the birds are alive again. No, they're not.
Uh, I think I should go back to the, get in the installation. Okay. Not much to do here. This memory won't last much longer. Okay, I'm going Discovering back to where this place. memory originated requires accessing restricted areas of the index. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's go back to the go installation. Go now. Before management takes control. Others all. Uh oh. Yeah. This is definitely the place to go. Ooh, look at the weird shadow. And now we're in fall, where before it was all green. Oh, things are getting dark. Things are getting dark. Uh oh. Oh, uh, which one is it? Let's do six, six, three, four. Nope. Nine, zero, zero. Actually, no, it was, we're three FO6. It's two, three, four, one. Ah, got it. So glad I wrote those down. Still getting this weird blackout thing going on and I can't move very fast. Feel like I'm moving through molasses. And it's all wet. The door is closed. Investor's not there. Access granted. Uh-oh, who's that? Is that me? Whoa! There are things you know for sure. Certainties. Those cycles and patterns. They become our truths and our facts. But from here, you see them for what they are. We're back in the room. This is the room. This is the room where it all began. With the chandelier and the post-processing volume. Uh, no particles this time, though. This we're in the far oh cool nice forest we're glitching it's a kitchen still a kitchen we got particle effects we got a post processing volume we're glitching Russian kitchen magnets. That is a nice touch, isn't it? Now it's gone. Hole in the wall? 10 after 10. Radio is on. Hey oh It's like that feeling when the threshold between who you are and what you could be is just about to be crossed. And then the truth comes rushing in again. 
and nothing changes. Your perseverance has been quite impressive. This is the end for me, but your path to the errant memory's origins is clear. For now. I had to sacrifice myself so you could succeed. I hope it's worth it. What you do with this information will determine your ultimate fate. Venera 17. Okay, that's one ending. It says, needs further investigation. Would you like to continue? Okay, let's continue. We can do more. Your preferred memories have been loaded into the chamber. And now it's a girl. You explored them for accuracy. An American girl. A woman. The data doesn't have to be foolproof. It's called science. Hmm. Go back. The data doesn't have to be foolproof. It's called science. This is the very first one. No dead birds. The birds fly away. And we're left here. Huh. I, I triggered that. It didn't trigger. Just saying. I did that. I would apologize, but unfortunately it would be insincere. Okay. Let's check the lab. This is the lab as we left it.
number A through E. It's B, C. As you can see, when entered into the simulation, the similarities are undeniable. Taking the past 5,000 years as a model, even solving for all the reductions, we are up against an extremely aggressive increase. A predominantly endothermic atmosphere is imminent. Given the correlation to where the initial emission is believed to have occurred, we have our answer. Either exposure to the holographic anomaly made us victim to the greatest Cold War tactic ever devised, or we have first contact, and it's a warning. This is new. Now we've got different light on everything. By dividing our efforts across the four installations, each team is to reconstruct the simulation and then replicate in parallel until parity is achieved. If any installation or research team shows signs of instability, the isolation will allow us to minimize the impact on the project for full. These measures should allow us to pinpoint the exact message contained from Alpha-1, even if it means rebuilding an entire neural mapping one simulated cell at a time. Okay, oh. and I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this. I feel like that first time through was the tutorial, and now we're very much on our own. By dividing our efforts across the 
march across the four installations. Each team is to yeah, reconstruct the simulation and then replicate it parallel. Let me see this again. Okay. And I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this. Shit. Oh, now the light is orange here. I would apologize, but unfortunately it would be insincere. We're in orange land. Again, this is essentially a post-processing. We're back to regular color. Well, actually, it's green now. We need new subjects to make new mistakes. The data doesn't have to be foolproof. It's called science. Same thing. Yeah, that's the same ending we got last time. But I think if I'd have left it red, I'd have gotten something different. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go go back, turn it red. Your preferred memories have been loaded into the chamber. Have you explored them for accuracy? Go to the here. I turned it red. Now these should be the people talking. Okay. And? I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this shit. Yeah. Okay. Actually. If I go... I always wait in the door. Set that. Let's boogie in, or at least. Okay, and I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this shit. Okay. Let's. This should still 
will be red, yes. Okay, now I'm gonna go straight to Venera 7. I only had a team that could deliver on my vision. Oh, that's new. Let's go to Venera 17. Or actually, let's go to the valley while we're red. There are... Dead, the birds are still flying. Okay, I think that's it. Flying away, but we're still red. That's good, let's get out. Still red here. Who should be terminated this time? black and white until you look closer. I did what I thought was right. Was it worth it? Different ending. Do the ends ever justify the means? We'll see. Okay. That's different. Ah, but now we're, this is red. This is new. Oh. Your preferred memories have been loaded into the chamber. Have you explored them for accuracy? Just want to check around in here. We need new subjects to make new mistakes. There are valid reasons to keep this from the rest of them. This was always fall. I feel like it was green the first time. Oh, there's the blue butterfly. Huh? This is new. I'm going towards the beeping. It's pretty dark. Can't go. Okay. And this is all shut down. So all I can do is go in here. Ah, that was new. Now we're in blue. Do you really think he could actually do it? Yeah, I suppose. Okay. We entered development without proper research. Now what? I agree with your question. Even if we build 
a cell by cell yeah, computer good. simulation of the human visual cortex. Okay. To scale this up, the amount of hardware required to simulate the entire neural network. I can get in here. Okay. It's blue, it's blue, it's blue. Same. Technical specification. Supplemental. Carter Bester, employee 0016. An additional routine has been installed to ensure passage if the memory simulations cannot be halted or reach unsafe recursion. If the system appears compromised, a failsafe can be initiated by a recursive overload recurring within a red shifted photo frequency. The keypad next to the input terminal can then be used to reset the system which point simply entering the corresponding codes will grant access to the classified non-index memory data without AI interference. Ooh. Without AI, so, okay. And I can't get in here. So it says I can enter things directly in the keypad without AI interference. I'm not quite following you. Is there a keypad? No. The only keypad I've seen, it also says I have to be redshifted. Do you really think you're smarter than everyone else? We need new subjects to make new mistakes. What if I do blue shift? I could short-circuit the chamber again, but that may result in permanent psychosis. You're still red, I'm blue. Let's go to the installation. The data doesn't have to be foolproof. It's called... Okay. So this is open. There's the butterfly. But we're already blue. Butterfly, remember that. Butterfly turns it blue. Oh, that's new. Okay. Now I'm here. Where's the keypad? dark here. I want to be able to enter things on the keypad without AI interference. science I can't believe this is what passes for acceptable I would apologize but Let's unfortunately this. okay this is new I got blue Remember when I told you I was you? Well, I wasn't you. You were me. How is that, you ask? 
I'm going forward, I made a by promise the way. to myself never to share that with you. That is something you must discuss on your own. And when you do, I won't need to tell you. You'll already know. Okay, that was blue ending. Let's continue. Okay. Out of blue. I can't believe this is what passes for acceptable. Is this meeting over yet? Uh, going back to the office. I'm gonna see if I can turn it red. said turn it red and then enter things directly into the keypad. Okay. I've turned it red. Just gonna look. Okay. And? I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this shit. Still red, hopefully. Still red. Now, is there a keypad? I could short circuit the chamber again, but that may result in permanent psychosis. Oh, we should unpack that statement. There's no keypad. Do you really think she could actually do it? What does that even mean? This cannot continue. You oversimplified the wave function. That was your first mistake. Okay. The only keypad I know is at the installation. So I'm going to try that. Okay, so last time I came down here and I used the terminal even though the door was open. Uh, hopefully the door is open. It is. There's no body in there. So let's try going up. Oh, there's a body. So let's try going straight in. Oh, this is new. it back normal. God damn it. Do you really think you're smarter than everyone else? I am sorry. That ship has sailed. Okay, let's try this again. Go back to the office. Turn it red. Okay. Hit Y. Go back to the main terminal. Do you really think he could actually do it? Can you state that more clearly? Go to the installation. It's possible you have a good point, but maybe not. Last time I stopped and turned around. This time I'm, I'm barreling forward. Okay. Going forward. Fast is our little feet 
Let's go carry us. Gray. Gray, we're going faster. 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 This is new. Still don't have a numerical keypad of any sort. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? What if we go in the Would chamber? Would the user be able to anything? find their way out? Tested against my latest theory. Nope. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? Would the user be able to find their way out? Yeah, black and white shifted. Remember, these are all uh, post processing. Uh, volumes. Okay, where to? I think we should just end it here. Do you really think she could actually do it? I'm doing I'm not it. quite following you. There are valid reasons to keep this from the rest of them. Yeah, that's different. The signal delivered with it the technology we used to rebuild the past. Its contents were broken, incomplete. We thought we understood its applications. But what we built, it was just one poor design on top of another until... this mess we're in now. But up there, high above all that pressure and scorching heat, the message was finally clear showing us the past and our future now I want you to see hmm oh, look at this <laughs> we're still shifted uh, okay. Let's continue. We're back. I want to do that again and, and experiment a little bit. We entered development without proper research. Now what? So I agree with you. Let's go red. Okay. Back home. Okay. I am sorry, that ship has sailed. And then the installation. And then we're going to white shift it. Shift it. Can't do anything with that. Faster, faster thing. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? Would the user be able to find their way out? Is this meeting over yet? subjects to make new mistakes. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? 
would the user be able to find their way out? This is normal. Can we simulate the I memory chamber red. inside the chamber? What do we do would last the user time? be able to find their way out? Last time I went and looked at the people before I left. I don't know if that's necessary. Oh, the, the other thing. Oh, this is open. What's up in here? There's the people. Okay. And? I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this shit. short circuit the chamber again, but that may result in permanent psychosis. Who should be terminated this time? this nothing wasn't fast enough. What happened? I can't believe this is what passes for acceptance. It. It's possible you have a good point, but maybe not. That time I got through two, but it was like I couldn't go fast enough to trigger it in time. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? Would the user be able to find their way out? Yeah. I can end it. Why don't we get to stay in this place? Who should be terminated this time? It's possible you have a good point, but maybe not. Sets it. <sighs> okay. Do you really think she could actually do it? Go straight to the Can you state that more clearly? It's possible you have a good point. Go here. See if there's anything to see in here. 
not turn it blue. Seems to be washed out green anyway. about this it's it's a bunch of static meshes and I'm freaking out looking at every single bit of it. that gets me back here. tested against my latest theory I could short circuit the chamber again but that may result in permanent psychosis I would apologize, but unfortunately, it would be insincere. Uh, your point being? What else can I do here? We read all that. By dividing our efforts across the four installations, each team is to you want to go to the other installation and then replicate in parallel until parity is achieved. If any installation or research team shows signs of instability, uh. the isolation will allow us to minimize the impact on the project from full. The should allow us to pinpoint the exact message contained. As you can see, when entered into the simulation, the similarities are undeniable. Taking the past 5,000 years as a model, even solving for all the reductions, we are up against an extremely aggressive increase. A predominantly endothermic atmosphere is imminent. Given the correlation to where the initial emission is believed to have occurred, we have our answer. Either exposure to the holographic anomaly made us victim to the greatest Cold War tactic ever devised, or we have first contact, and it's a warning. I am certainly willing to take any help chat can give me four installations one two three four 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 circles on the map gloomy red murk Ice crystal haze. That's what we're seeing. That's why there's a red version. And a blue version. the red version. Okay. What if we just go again? 
Still a red version. Redder. Let's try one more time. One more time. Okay, and I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this shit. Technical specification, supplemental. Carter Bester, employee 0016. An additional routine has been installed to ensure passage if the memory simulations cannot be halted or reach unsafe recursion. If the system appears compromised, a failsafe can be initiated by a recursive overload occurring within a range shifted <laughs> photo frequency. Nothing. Well, the thanks, Chad. Next to the input terminal can then be used to reset the system, at which point simply entering the corresponding codes will grant access to the classified non-indexed memory data. That's what I want to do. The keypad next to the input terminal can then be used to reset the system. I want that keypad. Technical specification. Supplemental. Carter Bester, employee 0016. An additional routine has been installed to ensure passage if the memory simulations cannot be halted or reach unsafe recursion. If the system appears compromised, a failsafe can be initiated by a recursive overload occurring within a red shifted photo frequency. So we're red. The keypad next to the input terminal can then be used to reset the system which point simply entering the corresponding codes will grant access to the classified non-indexed memory data without AI interference. That's what I want. Okay. That's over. Okay. Keypad next to the terminal. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? Would the user be able to find their way out? We're red shifted. There's only so much more of this I can take. I would apologize, but unfortunately it would be insincere. You may or may not have a good point. Huh. Nope. Look for a keypad. Do you really think she could actually do it? I'm not quite following you. oversimplified the wave function. That was your first mistake. We should unpack that statement. Uh, that's not how I would do it. <sighs> Perhaps we should adjust the numbers in the spreadsheet. Again. I am sorry, that ship has sailed. Uh, your point being? My business is people. Oh, we haven't gotten that one yet. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? Would the user be able to find their way out? There are valid reasons to keep this from the rest of them. Nothing. 
The data doesn't have to be foolproof. It's called science. Perhaps we should adjust the numbers in the spreadsheet. Again. Okay. Well. Uh. Back to the office. I'm already redshifted. There are valid reasons to keep... Redshifts. By dividing our efforts across the four installations, each team is to reconstruct the simulation and then replicate in parallel until parity is achieved. If any installation or research team shows signs of instability, the isolation will allow us to minimize the impact on the project from full. This measure should allow us to pinpoint the exact message contained from Alpha One, even if it means well, rebuilding cute, an entire cell Rerun six six nine one. Rerun four zero seven. Okay, and I honestly don't know. This isn't your place to be asking me this shit. Technical specification, supplemental. Carter Bester, employee 0016. An additional routine has been installed to ensure passage if the memory simulations cannot be halted or reach unsafe recursion. If the system appears compromised, a failsafe can be initiated by a recursive overload occurring within a red-shifted photofrequency. The keypad next to the input terminal can then be used to reset the system, at which point simply entering the corresponding codes will grant access to the classified non-indexed memory data without AI interference. That's what I want to do, but there's no keypad. Sorry, that ship has sailed. Let's try the installation again. Maybe there's a keypad next to the computer you terminal the in the installation. Function. That was your first. There's a keypad. Pressing A does nothing there. I've red shifted here. Got a terminal here. Oh, there's a keypad. How do I get that keypad? I got a keypad. Please input valid memory code. Let's try six 
six, three, four. What are valid memories? I don't have letters, or do I? Two. Uh, F. One, one. Nope. Um, oh. Clear. No, I don't have anything like this. Um, the codes, yes, I'm trying the codes that I've written down. 6634 is the first one, but see how, so I just had 7788, 7788, but notice how it's three numbers dash one. I think it's, um, what the radio was saying, which was like three, three, four. Five, two. I didn't write them down. Three, three, five, eight. Nope. Um, three, five, five, eight. know how to get valid memory code. Okay, but I know how to get back here. Okay, so let's try for running through this one. I need memory codes. only so much more of this I can take. But I don't re remember how to get back to where the, the radio was all like in the office. I think I have to be blue. So let's go to the installation if now. I only had a team that could deliver on my vision. Try and turn it blue. And I turn it blue by looking at the butterfly. It should be there. I got the butterfly, and this is nothing. Okay, let's go through here. All right, blue. Let's go to the office. My business is people. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the? Supplemental. Carter Bester, employee 0016. An additional routine has been installed to ensure passage if the memory simulations yeah. cannot be halted or reach an unsafe thing. recursion. If the system appears compromised, a failsafe can be initiated by a recursive overload recurring within a red shifted photo frequency. The keypad next to the input terminal can then be used to so reset the system. Memories. At which point, simply entering the corresponding codes will grant access to the classified non indexed memory data without AI interference. Source data. Yes. Three, 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 two, five, three, three, five, three, three, four, three, three, four. But that's not the right number. Three, two, 
of numbers. Looks like we can go green with the right circumstances. Maybe inside there. Two five three three four RGB shifted. Okay. B -b -b -b. Can we simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber? Would the user be able to find their way out? only had a team that could deliver on my vision. Is this meeting over yet? Let's go to the straight in. Oh, the, the terminal is out. The pad. Access denied. Well, okay. I don't know. And I can't get in here while it's while that's going. On. Access denied. Ooh. Is 
anyone eavesdropping on our conversation? We need new subjects to make new mistakes. I could short-circuit the chamber again, but that may result in permanent psychosis. Oh, we got a giant butterfly. That's new. Perhaps we should adjust the number. Okay, what about the crew member ID, the one you needed to use to get into the locked rooms? You may or may not have a good point. Okay. But they're always unlocked now, so I can't I can't hear those anymore. And I didn't write them down. Who should be terminated this time? Uh That's normal. Okay. The data doesn't have to be foolproof. It's called science. Yeah, see, the, the cube is out here, so those rooms are unlocked. Yeah, I was thinking the dates on the memories. There are valid reasons to keep this from the rest of them. But There's only it would be 2-2. Two, two. Is this meeting over yet? Let's see. But the dash is in the wrong place, so it would be 2-2... Two, two, What's April? Uh, January, February, March, April, 04. Uh, 1905. There's only so much more of this I can take. 0704. Let's try them. I could short circuit the chamber again, but that may result in permanent psychosis. Let's go turn it red. simulate the memory chamber inside the chamber would the user be able to find their way out is this meeting over yet okay Two, two, oh, four. Nope. Let's try oh, four, two, two. I doubt it. This is British. One, nine, oh, five. Seven zero four. Oops. Seven. Zero. Nope. So those are the dates on the memories. thing I can think is we've got the letters on the keypad um, even though they don't show up so like X 
zero zero one. Bastards employee zero zero one six. So that was one of the employee numbers. Nope. Uh, ba -ba. And last time we tried this, we were in blue. Oh yeah, it opens, okay. Let's try and shift it white. Why not? Nope. Says it. Oh, fuck. Do you really think he could actually do it? What does that even mean? Uh, that's not how I would do it. Got the top the uh, times the fifteen fifty eight. Try those. Do you really think she could actually do it? Can you state that more clearly? This is not a success. I demand an apology. Well, let's just go. Do you really think he could actually do it? Mm-hmm. Let's see if it's still down in this color. I think it's still down. Yeah, it's still down. Something stupid, you know it's gonna be something stupid. And this should not let us in. There's only so much more of this I can take. Okay, I, I think I'm going to call it here because um, I'm baffled and we're just repeating ourselves. Uh, thanks for watching, XXO Cat. Uh, you really if you're watching this on YouTube, uh, can you hope you saw the cool stuff the and fast forwarded hands. through the boring stuff. Um, I'm going to try and figure this out or uh, failing that. Uh, I'm gonna go and look at a guide. Um, so okay. Perhaps we should adjust uh, the numbers in the spreadsheet. We are Again, done for the day. There are valid reasons. Boo, boo, boo. Quit. Yes. And let's stop the stream. Okay. See ya. Remember to like and subscribe, whatever.